In this video, we're going to search for some OER using YouTube uh, and then insert it into our OER textbook, which is sitting in Guru. Uh, first of all, let's do a search in the regular YouTube uh, search field. I'm interested in real numbers, for example, and um, the results that are returned are really um, a combination of both the standard YouTube license and open education resources. So we're going to use the filter button at the top corner to uh, filter only Creative Commons materials. From these results, we can now choose which of these OERs are particularly useful. Um, I'm going to have a look at this one here. You might see that I've already seen it before and um, you can review the resource and decide to what extent it's useful. Um, once you've made your decision though, we need to take the URL. So the easiest way to do that um, is really just to right click the video and say copy the video URL. Okay, so we've returned to our course and now we want to insert the URL of the YouTube video as a resource. So I'm going to scroll down. Here's my consumer arithmetic section. There is lesson one, which is my specific objective number one, and there's the collection. Uh, so I go into the collection and now we'll see that there is a add resource or question button. So I'm going to click on there. I'm going to add in a resource. Now the URL is still in memory so I can just paste it in. This particular video is on calculating discounts and I can say that it is a video. There's an add button, click and you'll see now that there is um, the first resource for the specific objective. Um, I want to do another one. I can either click the Add button again, or you now have an additional plus new resource button. And now I can compile the OERs in the sequence that I require them in order for the learner to achieve the specific objective.